today is vlogmas day two it's thursday so um i just got dressed i do have a few things that i need to do work wise um i have a campaign with mattress firm that i'm working on so i need to film the instagram story for that um, I have a few boxes that I need to open. I ordered some stuff from Sephora. So I'll probably show you guys what I got. Um, yesterday, my camera broke. So we're thinking about going to Best Buy to get another one. Um, oh, okay. you just, my camera just broke. You didn't slap it off the table. <laughs> I did not slap it off the table. It was sitting on the counter. I went to move it or something and it got um, front heavy. And it literally, it I did not. It literally just went boot and it hit the um, the towel. So um, yeah, now it won't even, y'all hear that? Like it won't even open all the way. You can like pull it out. But um, yeah, I like filming with this camera because it's a little bit smaller, especially if we're out and about. If I'm at home, then filming with the camera that I have is fine. But um, yeah, if we're gonna be out and about, then I prefer to have this little small camera. So I was gonna order it on Amazon, but it said um, it wouldn't be here until like the 8th and I don't wanna wait that long. So um yeah i checked um best buy and it said that i could pick it up today so we might do that um if we don't do that today then we'll do it tomorrow because i definitely want to get this camera um so that i can vlog with it but um this is a sony i'm not sure the exact um the sony zv1 and i really like this camera because it's small and compact so yeah, so now I'm about to do the Instagram story for Mattress Firm. I'm going to show you guys our bedroom. I added a few little festive things. Not too much, but um, yeah, I have a full video coming on my Nitra B channel. Um, cleaning and decorating our bedrooms for Christmas. So yeah, hopefully I will get that up soon. Um, I just need to finish editing it. So here's a really quick overview for the bed. I just added these pillows. So the white ones have Christmas trees and snowflakes and the one in the very front says meet me under the mistletoe. I got the pillows from Pottery Barn and I just wanted to keep everything very neutral since our bedroom's already neutral. I didn't want to throw like a bold color in here. This is the Christmas tree. I got it from Hobby Lobby and I also kept the decorations on here very neutral with the gold. Little snowflake is falling. Let's pop you back up here, girl. So yeah, I think that it turned out really nice. I love the way that it looks. Not too much, but just enough to give a little festive feel in the bedroom. And then I think I showed you guys my little vanity area not too long ago. Um, so I added this to our bedroom whenever we um, did the renovation and made my old beauty room to Uriah's new bedroom. We did that whenever um, we were getting ready to have Ezra because we needed the extra space. So now my beauty space is in the basement, but I don't want to go in the basement to get dressed every day. So I just wanted to have this so I could get ready in the morning. So yeah, this is my little setup. I got um, the vanity from, where's that vanity from? Mod Shop. I got the vanity from Mod Shop. And then this chair, I love this chair. I picked it up from a local furniture store called the White House Interiors. And I just thought it fit perfectly in here and it goes with all the rest of the neutral decor. So yeah, I still need to figure out like the organization and stuff for it, but yeah, that's where I get ready most of the time in the mornings. So yeah, everything's really neutral. Just the way that I like it. We've got Israel's little bassinet. Um, I did think about um, getting some new nightstands and dressers, but I think that these still work. So we'll probably just end up keeping these for a while. And I got these forever ago. Um, actually, the dresser is from Z Gallery, and I got it during a Black Friday sale like six, seven years ago. It was a really great deal. And I was telling you guys, I picked up a few things from Sephora. So I just got two perfumes and a few lip products. You guys know I am obsessed with perfumes. These are more of like my everyday perfumes. I do air quotes when I say that. Um, yeah, everyday. But these are really just the ones that I reach for a little bit more 
regular than my other ones so yeah i have a whole other stash in my closet but i keep these on a vanity because i've just been reaching for them more regularly and i'm gonna go ahead and smell these because i bought these blindly like i had never smelled them before but i just kind of read the notes and thought that i would like them and both of these perfumes are by killian i think i'm saying that right i don't know i could be totally butchering it but um i have seen this perfume they have a few different ones um this one is roses on ice i love the packaging very pretty it's going to look cute sitting on the vanity. Ooh, okay. Just from initial smell, it smells really good. But you have to kind of see how it's going to work with your body chemistry. Okay, let's get it started. Pump it up. Okay. Ooh, very nice. It's fresh. It's really fresh. Um, I don't really have anything like this in my collection. But there is something that I'm getting like after the initial smell that I'm not really sure about. I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, this one is the Roses on Ice. Um, yeah, that after smell was kind of giving me something that I'm not real sure about. So um, we'll see. I don't know if I'm going to keep this one just based off of, I don't know, something about that after smell. I don't know. I don't know what it is. But anyway, so this next one is called Apple Brandy. Um, I have tried this um, Killian before. I have, um, it's in the black packaging. If you guys have tried the perfumes before, it's in that black packaging. It's like a ball on the top and like a square on the bottom. So yeah, I've tried um, a fragrance that's in that packaging and I really liked it. It's like a marshmallow fragrance. Um, I can't remember the name, but um, anyways, this one's called Apple Brandy. Okay, I feel like this one's definitely more of my speed versus the Roses on Ice. Um, yeah. Yeah, the Apple Brandy, I think, is definitely more of what I'm used to wearing. There's something about that Roses on Ice. I don't know if I really like it. It was something like the After Smell, but yeah. Um, I got both of these perfumes. I'm going to for sure keep this Apple Brandy one. And if you guys have any perfume recommendations, let me know. Um, I do have quite a few perfumes. So, yeah, I'll probably show you guys all of my collection really soon. Maybe on, like, Instagram um, Reels or something like that. I know this is pretty, pretty popular for people to talk about perfumes and stuff on there. But, yeah, I got a few other things. And these are, like, lip products. Um... This is actually one of the um, contour sticks by Fenty. And then um, this is a lip color. I got the shade Uncensored. I love a red lip, especially during the holidays. Like, you cannot beat that classic red. So, yeah, I wanted to try this out. I haven't tried out any of their lip products before. And then this is also a lip paint. This one's called Uncuffed of a neutral kind of mauve shade these are like the colors that i wear um i just like to keep it pretty neutral and then this one is the lip souffle matte lip cream by rare beauty and it's also a red color i just really love like a burgundy red and then this is by sephora this is just like a just like a little shine if you want to add that shine to your lips um nothing too over the top just for like an everyday look so um yeah these were actually on sale so i picked up that too So I just got the boys ready for bed. You ready to get to bed, baby? Oh, I'm still drawing. You drawing? Yeah. 
<laughs> Ray loves to draw. You want to um, hold Ezra? I thought you wanted to hold Ezra before you went to bed. Yes. Yeah. You want to show everybody your room? Yes, look at it. Do you like it? It actually has a broad jade. A broad jade. Break it. It's downstairs. Guys, do you like my Christmas tree? I'm sure they love your Christmas tree. Okay, you want to hold a baby? Yes. Before you go to bed? Okay. Sit up against the pillow. Hey, Ezra. Hey, Ezra. Guys, look at me and Ezra. We're so cute. <laughs> and we're the same people. Y'all are the same people. Yes, Ezra just she wants to play. You want to yes. play? Yeah. <laughs> To go to go. All right, you go and then the mm -hmm. guys, look at my LeBron James. Yep, this is LeBron James blanket. Yeah, I really like it. You love it? Yeah. Oh. Well, I'll put, I'll let Ezra have it. Oh, that's so sweet. You gonna let Ezra have your blankie? Yeah. Aww, he likes so it. He does. Oh, look at you, Ezra. <laughs> you look so handsome. <laughs> Look at Spaceship. This is called Spaceship. It is called Welcome spaceship. to the Spaceship. All right, Ryan, you ready to say your prayers? Yes. Now, let me. Now, let me. Down to sleeps. I pray to Lord. My soul that keeps. My angels watch me. Put them back. And with my Monday light. Amen. Amen.